Tech TV, Experience Educational Television. Good morning, lovely viewers. You're watching Tech TV Live, reporting from the hearts of KNUST Campus Kumase. My name is Irona Efriye Obusu. Today, we find ourselves at the Law Auditorium, where the Publishing Studies Department of KNUST has organized an entrepreneurship graduation and award ceremony for its final year students. Even as they are making it in their own small way in Accra, a very busy city, they always find time to come back to the alma mater. Last year, they were here, the two of them. The two key members of a company leaving their job buy their own ticket. We don't pay for their ticket. We don't pay anything to them. We don't give them a dime because we don't have it. But they come. They honor every invitation. When they come, they don't come with hole in their pocket. They come with sold and sold pockets. Last year, they gave us money to the best students. For over 10 years, they were sponsoring us over 1,000 every month. And I think 2014, when I was leaving, through its instrumentality and that of Dr. Asare Kufu, they deposited 50,000 Ghana cities into our accounts <laughs> to promote entrepreneurship. But it's moved on to another bank, consolidated. So you are gradually consolidating themselves. So I know when they are well established, the sponsorship will start coming from Isaac. I have another son here, another Isaac. And when you see names of Isaac, be careful with them. They are sharp guys. Isaac, you also know him as a resource person. And he's also been helping coordinating activities, not only at the Center for Business Development, but also as a focal person in our Ghana office. It's equal to business. And sometimes when I define my own uh, meaning to business, I say it's any enterprise that has customers. I say any enterprise that has customers because if you have one customer, you are in business. If you have a thousand, you are in business. Now, if you have a thousand and your numbers dwindle, reduces, then it tells you the rates of your retrogressions. It tells you where you're going. But as you increase from one to two, then it tells you you are increasing. Business is key in every aspect of our economy. Entrepreneurship study is thriving in most of the developing countries, including Ghana. And indeed, countries that have seen poverty rates decline in most of this part has taken entrepreneurship and has applied it in a very economical way. We see this program as an opportunity for us to keep a tap on what we do and to um, keep a tap on how we grow. So I see this as a responsibility um, on myself and my team that there are people out there who look up to us and we cannot afford to fail them. So each and every year that we come here, we need to improve upon our story, what we have done so far, what we continue to do. So thank you very much for making me wake up every day and try to achieve something greater with my team. Thank you. I'm Ifa Opondansua. The entrepreneurship course was um, taught us how to be entrepreneurs, like how to identify a problem in society and how to find ways of solving that problem. So it's, it was all about being creative and being able to identify a problem in the society. And I, I think the course was a very good one 
because afterwards I realized I had learned a lot. Um, my name is Steven Bandoma. Even the institution alone is something that came with its own excitement and coming to stand here today as the overall best student is something that I'm really excited about and the effort that has really went into it. This is something that came about with my own perseverance, determination, trying to look at where I want to get to and what I will do after school with these studies. So far we've sponsored um, two students. Um, my award, the Casey Amase Award, uh, we started three years ago. So this is the third student we've just sponsored. Um, the first one is into NGOs and then she has a couple of projects running uh, where she educates the elderly and uh, do health screening programs for them. Um, the second one who is currently doing her service um, is into hair uh, products and uh, uh, beauty. Um, um, I have to say that by virtue of the mentoring program, she has now employed people who work for her and then they move uh, home to home, office to office to fix people's hair. So the whole idea is to encourage people to start things on their own so that we don't finish and become a burden on the nation expecting somebody else to give us a job. Yes, I think it is. It's, um, it's not going to take care of everything of them, but it's more of motivation to just urge them on that. In however small the sports may be, um, this is just to tell them um, whatever they are doing, we, we support them, we, we, we're behind them and that they are um, doing the right thing, they are in, on a good course. And so that's why we go all in too. But then the, the financial support is not the main thing that we, we, we put to them. We try to train them and give them mentorship and give them all the support that they could come um, as long as they come close to us, as long as they come in our space. Um, our company, which is Blue Vine Limited, has a training program. So every period we are able to um, train attachment students that comes to us and by extension um, after they have left us. Tech TV, experience educational television.